It must be love, love, love. Bow, bow, bow. It must be love. Another condo there, look. Hey, is that the expat life? Hey, big old place in there, isn't it? Right, dudes, touching down from another day in Hua Hin City. And today we've got another another action-packed day. So yeah, I'm starting off early again. Had another amazing night's sleep in this cool basic hotel. Had me coffee again this morning. And yeah, this is this is a nice place. It's really basic. Um, if you stayed here for a month, it probably it would be a lot cheaper. But yeah, nobody gives you any grief here. You just get on. They haven't cleaned the room. I think you got to ask to clean the room. What's the bike like this morning? You have to put some juice in the bike. So I've only got the bike till today. So I might have to stop off and say, I want to keep it longer. I, I was going to change the bike, but I'm just going to keep this click now. So I think she does lovely, man. She does lovely around the city. And that's, that's all I need. 150 click. Perfect. Ah, another glorious day. Not too hot yet either. So the plan today is, when I went down to the um, the beach with a mountain in the earlier vlogs, I didn't go to Monkey Mountain. I didn't see the the um, temple or the Buddha around the back. And yeah, I really want to see it. So this morning, that's where we're going. We're going back down there and we're going to look at the Monkey Mountain. And I'm a bit sceptical because... I've heard stories that the monkeys can take take your stuff, take your belongings. So, yeah, with the camera, I'm gonna have to be extra careful. But I want to see all the monkeys and and the temple on the mountain or the statue, whatever it is. So, if you don't see this vlog, some monkeys on a mountain vlogging with my GoPro. <laughs> Hopefully not. Fingers crossed. I'm really liking this new um, start procedure as well. The new key on the click. All you gotta do is have the key in your pocket, then you just press the button, and it's cool, man. Well, you don't even have to get the key out or nothing. How about the skid lid they gave me? <laughs> I look good, man. It's the worst helmet ever, mate. Worst helmet. But you gotta wear it in Huahin. There is loads of police in Huahin. Right, so hopefully I'm gonna show you a little bit. Because when it gets crazy, I won't be able to. Let's go, man! Huahin! About 7.30 in the morning. I got to fill up again as well. I'm only down to two bars. Nice area of town this is. This is the area I like already. Not the trendy area. It's quiet, it's like rush hour as well. Half seven. I suppose the school runs another half an hour or another hour away, isn't it? Oh, nice breeze, man, nice breeze. What's your name? Oh, that's a long name. 95. 
No, 95. You sure? It's okay. 97. Right then. She's putting in 97. Never seen that before. But she said it's okay. So I finally made it to Wat Kao Takiap. In the earlier vlogs, I was just on the beach. I didn't actually come to the mountain, did I? And yeah, the little buggers are everywhere, man. Coming up, coming up the mountain there, they are everywhere. So here we are. I can't just come along the beach and not go up to the temple on the mountain, right? Hey, they come, look, monkeys. The little buggers are everywhere. Bit of a steep climb. Got a monkey there chilling halfway up, look. Got loads of them over here too. They're all coming over this way. <laughs> Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. There's a guy, look. Look at this monkey chilling. Chilling out. Got this guy coming down, look. There he goes. Wahin. Looking an absolute dazzler. Made it. Didn't need an ambulance. It's not too bad. It's not the steepest, not like Rambo Temple or nothing, or even Doi Sutep. Ah, yeah, beautiful in it. Calm, calm waters. Got the fishing boats out there. Ah. Whoo! Yeah, nice. Don't tell me that's it. All right. Can go up further. No, no, that's it. That's it, man. Yeah. I'm sure there is a... It's a big Buddha somewhere. Golden Buddha, I thought it was. I'm sure. That must be it down there. Ah, yeah, I had to come and see, though. I had to come and see the temple, Monkey Mountain. So this here, look, this is what they bring stuff up with. They reel it up when they need to bring up shopping or what have you. More stuff for the temple. Shopping, yeah, they won't be bringing shopping up here. But normally there's like monk digs up here, places where they stay, but they don't look like there is here. So they must just bring up stuff for the temple. It's crazy how the monkeys and the dogs just mix together down there. Like, they don't care one bit, so used to it, I suppose. Ah, this is a good view, isn't it? That's a good view, the beach over there. Look at all the hotels again. See, there's more up there as well. But we can't do everything, man. Oh, happy days, oh, happy days. That's across this one off. 
Yep, really wanted to come here. I wouldn't say like it's the best. It's not very well maintained either, I don't think. But I suppose when you've got all these monkeys running around, it's not the easiest thing to clean up, is it? Here we go, we've got this chap here, look. Don't want to get too close. Let's get a shot of him now. There he's look, chilling. We got these little rascals down here. This little rascal. So yeah, they're so used to people. See them all up there, lit on the roof. <laughs> They're so used to people, right? But I'd say if you got too close, they would have a nasty, nasty snap at you. What a shot that is, what a shot that is. Buddha, a bunch of monkeys. Oh, they're all having a scrap. They're all having a scrap, man. Uh, yeah, they're everywhere. They're all around my bike. Good job I locked the bike up. And yeah, on the way down, we're going to stop off at some um, some of the condos. We're going to have a little walk and talk down near the condos, where all the trendy condos are. I thought that would be cool on the way down. Look at them all. Yeah, they're all waiting for food, aren't they? Thousands of them. Hundreds of them. They're all down here. Oh, waiting to get fed. There they go. They're getting fed, look. All getting the food. Fighting. Yeah, fighting. Let's get out of here, man. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Monkey magic, monkey magic. Hey, it's pretty run down up here though. It's, yeah, it's not really well maintained. For a temple, I thought it, I thought it would be. These guys down the bottom, they're like me, just chilling away from all the, all the others. <laughs> right, let's go and have a look down the bottom. We're gonna go and have a look at some of the condos. Hello chap, how are you doing? See down the bottom here, down the bottom of the um, mountain, got like, this seafood, seafood market. All fresh stuff, look. Dude, Chiang Mai, the seafood, it's gonna be fresher here, isn't it, of course. Chiang Mai's gotta be shipped in. Yeah, straight off the sea lip, straight off the water. <laughs> God, even that smell. 
Reminds me of home. Trawler fish. I really enjoyed that. Really enjoyed that. That little mission this morning. I've been at Monkey Mountain now. There's probably more to see of it. You could explore along them mountains for all day, I suppose. But that's all I needed to see. Have a quick look. Got a um, condo building there. We're not going to look there though. We're going to go up further where I've seen a, seen a big batch of them. Well, we can have a little walk and talk. I really want to talk more about Huahin now, but I'm saving it for my for my final thoughts vlog. Where I'm going to talk about what I think. Just back from the beach, back from the mountain. Got this stretch of road that goes back into town and they got all these um what well, I'd say is trendier condos, probably where probably where a lot of the expats do live. So I thought we'd just have a little walk up here just to show you so you can get an idea for people that haven't been here and maybe interested to see what's on offer. I mean if I was here longer I would go probably ask to do an hotel review or condo review, Ban San Suk. So this is a placelet where you could get a room, get a condo. Condominium for sale. So you got places here. Let's just see where I park the bike again. Do not enter, private places. It's got places for sale in here. You can buy one of them, look. Nice little place, isn't it? Looking out over, right near the bay, right near the beach. New real estate, Ban Swat Rim Sai. And over here, lit. Got restaurants all in that down here as well. I still prefer, I prefer the older end where I'm in. Well, maybe not older, the more, less touristy sort of place, I think. You have a couple places there, look. So you've got another place here. All gated community. Just your normal condos. I know a lot of you back home, back home, back in Chiang Mai, I suppose it is my home, said like, these places are too small and you're boxed in. Basically, that's what they're like. You're boxed in, saving space. Probably get a small kitchen, small room. And they're probably building, building more on this waste ground. Got some land for sale. Yeah, so this place is getting built lit by the looks of it. Or was that the place I've seen down there? It looks nice, doesn't it? Like to go in there right on the beach, man. Ah, see, yeah, new place. So, yeah, he wouldn't let me film in there, but get a quick look of it behind. That's a new place getting built. Hopefully, he had a little shot. He wouldn't let me wouldn't let me film. And you got your um, do-it-yourself petrol. We have seen these in Pi, where you put your money in and you fill up yourself. Hello, chap. Hello, how are you? Yeah, you good? <laughs> Hello, yes. Look at this boy come running out. He heard me, didn't he? Yes. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. little ankle biter, you. Little ankle biter. <laughs> Take it easy, buddy. Yeah, see you again. Yeah, he's happy pigney. Full of energy. It must be love, love, love. Bam, bam, bam. It must be love. Another condo there, look. 
Hey, is that the expat life? Yeah, big old place in there, isn't it? Big old place. My resort, Wahin. It must be love, love, love. Down, down, down. It must be love. What about that one? They're yeah, not bad. Little drum. Small condos, I reckon. Nice though, isn't it? Nice. Nice and chilled. There's, uh, there's not a lot of traffic on the roads during the day, I've not found. It's like the rush hour time. Same as Chiang Mai, really. But Wahin, yeah, it does get busy along the main stretch. Weekends, Friday night, Saturday night. But other from that, there's the market I was in. Cicada Market. Oh, that's the food market. I forget the name of that one. Here's the Cicada area. Cicada, Cicada. <laughs> they had a jolly good time in that. Nothing more, nothing less. Wahin is the best. Do do do, do do do, do do do, do do do. Had a bit of madness on this morning. Welcome to the house of fun. Da -na 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 -na. Welcome to the house of fun. In the middle of our street, Wahin. In the middle of our street, our house. Yes, mate, loved it. Right, gonna put the camera away, get back into town, and God knows what we're gonna be doing next. Right, so I was meant to be going to look at this luxury place near the um near the water near the sea i went and it would all close down so that that sort of ruined that end of the vlog so i think i'm gonna leave it here for this one guys and yeah went to the monkey mountain had a look around some condos had a bit of a drive through town and yeah in a minute i'm about to go on a road trip and film another vlog so so yeah i'm gonna leave it there guys hope you're all safe and sound as always and i'll see you in the next one where we're about in Hua Hin and maybe a little bit further afield so I'll see you soon take it easy man take it easy